I haven't chosen a doula. I already had one. A little weird, but good. A doula birdie, not a doula. <laughs> <laughs> We're not using a doula. Really? Who's your midwife? Oh, no, no, no. Midwives and doulas are for when the husband's clueless or doesn't want to be involved, and I'm neither of those things. I'm really looking forward to being involved. That's great, Bertie. I totally understand, and I think that's great, but don't you think Verona might want someone there who really understands the female experience? Oh, there's this great Simone de Beauvoir quote. I can't remember the book, but I'll find it for you. It's something like, one is not born, but becomes a woman. Mm. Mm. What does that have to do with? But it's worth it. The pain is so enlightening. And now having experienced childbirth, I watch CNN and I really feel like I understand war. On top of which, when I had Wolfie, I had the most enormous orgasm. It was so beautiful. This soup is delicious. Oh. Alice Walker said, there's nothing more important than how we enter this world. And I agree with her. And my mom had a hospital birth. Oh. The stirrups, and the machines, and the drugs. And she wonders why I can't walk into a dry cleaner without vomiting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Can that maybe be the last bit of parental advice we get tonight? Just a, just a thought. Honey, you counting on this job interview tomorrow? At, where is it? It's Mutual choice? No, not really. Because I'm already doing fine. This would just be a better commission rate. <laughs> what is it again exactly that you do, Rod? The, what do you mean? How do I make my living? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Don't worry, Wolf. You won't ever have to do anything like that. Like anything like that? Roderick. Um, like like uh, fear mongering? Fear mongering? Or skimming? Roderick, honey. Uh, cajoling? Billing? Roderick, you, you taxing? You about Roderick, Roderick, it's so easy to forget how great the economic divide is these days. These guys have nothing. How should we expect them to know anything about anything? And Veronica lost her parents. Honey, how old were you when they died? 22. Why? Oh, you poor thing. I was just wondering how much your mama was able to pass on to you about motherhood before she died. Your people have such a wonderful oral tradition. Okay, that's it. That's it. You're a terrible person. Did you know that? You are terrible. People. And Verona, she's twice the woman that you'll ever be. Because this whole thing, I just, I never, I'm, I'm sorry because, and this guy, look at him. Oh, honey. Bert, we are leaving. And I hate these slippers. What's going on? You know what? If I have to explain it to you, Looney Tunes, just forget it. You're right. Just fly away, Bertie. Fly away and take that shitty stroller with you! Gladly! You fucking lunatic. Actually, I forgot something. Bert, honey. Honey, what are you doing? Hey, won't be. Want to get in the stroller? Wolfie. <laughs> okay. Let's we'll we'll take a little no. ride. Wolfie, don't listen. Don't be really it's okay. Honey, honey sports car. Honey, you do exactly as you like. Sweetheart, well, sweetheart, no, listen, to heart. Heart. No, listen to your heart. Listen to your heart. Get out of here. Stop it. 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 Bert, I reject your aggression. I reject your unbelievable bullshit. No. Yes. Wolfie, did you have fun? Because you won't have that much fun until you discover oral pleasure. What a horse's ass. <laughs> there we go.